Good morning, YouTube. Good morning, YouTube. How are you doing this morning? <clears throat> I hope everybody is um, doing well, up and about, getting active, getting their warm-up on, getting their movements started, their mobility, making sure that they are ready and excited about the day. Because you never know when you're going to have another day. We, we have so many things in life that are is trying to kill us on a regular basis. We just never know if we're gonna live to see the next day. So appreciate the one you're in. Pay attention to the one you're in. Hug your loved ones in the one you're in. Because we really don't know if the one tomorrow is coming. We think it is, we hope it is, we assume that it is, but we really don't know. But what's up everybody, this is Coach DC of the Intense Fit Way. Coach DC, and this is the March 1st reading of the Daily Stoic. The March 1st reading, and I especially wanted to read this one, <clears throat> especially in our time of um, our time of mental illness or lack of self-control and self-knowledge. I don't, I would, I don't want to say self-worth because I think that's a part of self-control and self-knowledge. When you understand that your life itself, it brings about a new accountability and responsibility. Mm. But anyway, let me get to this. Where philosophy begins, the March 1st reading of the Daily Stoic. An important place to begin in philosophy is this, a clear perception of one's own ruling principle. An important place to begin in philosophy is this, a clear perception of one's own ruling principle. Epictetus. Philosophy is intimidating. Where does one start? With books, with lectures, with the sale of your worldly possessions, none of these things. Epictetus is saying that one becomes a philosopher when they begin to exercise their guiding reason, reason and start to question the emotions and beliefs and even language that others take for granted. It is a thought that an animal has self-awareness when it is able to fully recognize itself in a mirror. Perhaps we could say that we begin our journey into philosophy when we begin when we become aware of the ability to analyze our own minds. I'm going to go back and read that one again for the people in the back. I know there's somebody that missed that one, and that one cannot be missed right there. It is, a, it is thought that, a man, that an animal has self-awareness when it is able to fully recognize itself in a mirror. Perhaps we could say that we begin our journey into philosophy will we become aware of the ability to analyze our own damn minds. Can you start with that step today? When you do, you'll find that from it, we really come alive. That we live lives, to paraphrase, to paraphrase <clears throat> Socrates, that are actually worth living. Can you start that today? Can you start to analyze your mind today? Can you start to analyze your mind and your thoughts today, your emotions, and understand why you have them? Are they helpful? Are they harmful? Which way do they have you going? Do they have you going in a, a nasty, ugly way? Do they have you going in a positive way? Have you balanced yourself out? Have you? Philosophy begins when we are become aware of the ability to analyze our own damn minds. When did you become that? When did you become aware of that ability, or have you analyzed yourself? Do you stop at the end of your day, analyze the things you did, the things you said, why you said them, the mood you were in, the emotions that you were feeling at the time? Do you? I do it a couple of times every day. I listen to a lot of people. I listen. I don't accept to take in everything, but I listen to a lot of people. But my family, I try to hug them every day. I try to love my daughter every day. I try to love my wife every day. I try to hug them and kiss them and give them as much as myself as I can every single day. And every day I'm trying to do better. Every day. Where philosophy begins, <clears throat> when you can analyze your own damn mind. Can you start today? Because we got to start today. Because people are not analyzing their minds. We're, we're going off of emotion right here. We see all these emotional sheep running around acting crazy and stupid and putting on pussy hats. 
you know that there was no analysis done in that process. Couldn't have been. You, there must be reasons with, with the emotions. There must be reasons with the emotion. There must be thought with the emotions. Thought, emotion, deed. Well, no, no. Thought, word, deed. And word is the emotion. Deed is the expression. Thought is the beginning. Where are you at? Peace.